What's up researchers, the guru here. I'm back with another Mendeley video. This time I'm showing you how to insert page numbers in your citation. By default, Mendeley does not include page numbers, but if you are required to include page numbers in your citation, then you need to watch this video, okay? If you're a first time visitor to my channel, please click on the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to be notified whenever there's a new upload. Remember to like, comment and share this video. Okay, let's get to it. What are the tools that I'm going to be using? I'm going to be using Google, of course, Google Scholar, Microsoft Word, and then my Mendeley. So if I get into my uh, Google Scholar and then just search for a, an article that I want to page numbers. So in other words, I need to download a PDF file that I can work with, okay? So I'm gonna scroll down and then um, use this one. This one is a PDF, but it's a book. So I'm gonna use this one, which is an article because it said PDF here. So right click on it and then open in a new tab, right? Uh, it's gonna open. The other way is when you have the article that you want, you can copy the name here, right? And then paste in Mendeley and do a literature search there. Uh, I have recorded a video on how you can do literature search in Mendeley and how you can import a citation uh, or a reference from Google Scholar to, 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 to Mendeley. So um, you, you can check on the uh, sliding card at the top there. You'll be able to have a look at that video. All right, so uh, I have downloaded that article and I have it here. I can save this PDF wherever I want to save to. But then uh, let's say I want to cite uh, something that is coming from the background uh, section, which is here and it's appearing on page two of 17. All right, so the first thing that I want to do is I want to import this into Mendeley. Uh, so I'm just going to copy this name, All right? Go into Mendeley and then go under literature search okay? and then paste that article that you, you want to search for and then search it in there. Like I said, I have a video already that is giving you a description of, of that, uh, of this process. Right, uh, so this is the article that I'm interested in. So I'm just gonna double click it and then save. I, I will have it in my um, in my old documents uh, and it's right here, okay? So this is the paper that I want to cite. You can see it's written by Jennings. Uh, if you go to Google, uh, you see that the authors for this are, is Jennings and, and others, okay? So I want to cite this particular paper right and the stuff that i'm going to cite from here is actually going to be coming from page 2 of 17 under the background section so i let's say i am citing a statement uh this one okay so take that statement go into microsoft word paste it there i'm going to record a video as well of how you can do paraphrasing when you are citing you don't copy and paste like i did now this uh, will increase your plagiarism percentage uh, percentage number so you want that number to go down so you don't copy and paste like I, I did now but you do paraphrasing but right now i'm just copying and pasting so that i can do a demo of how to insert page numbers so the purpose of this document is to how how to insert page numbers so don't worry about the copying and pasting that i'm doing right now okay so i have my set my, my, my words that i am uh, using from that article and they're sitting here and they're coming from page number two the next thing that i want to do now is to insert that um uh, uh, cit citation so let me say jennings right there you go right jennings and then well, there are two ways that you can do this so for now i'm just going to click okay so it will input uh that uh, citation at the end of the text okay there we have it okay and then now i want to include the page number here so what i can do is i can click on that citation right and then have the edit citation right i've got another video that i've uh, done already that talks about uh how to edit citations or why you edit citations okay check on the sliding card at the top there and click on it you'll be able to see the title and the video as well that is talking about editing editing citations okay i'm going to edit citation and then click on that citation under page num a page here i've got an option to add numbers right if i click on that drop down i've got a whole lot of uh options there but the one that i'm interested in now is page okay and remember i said that my citation is coming from page two of seven okay so um uh, if I go there and say page two, right, and then click OK, it will edit my citation and then put two at the end. 
and then according to the style that has been selected here the page number is put like that so it's authors at r because there are many others 2020 comma two okay but if you change the style and say i'm not interested in chicago manual i'm actually interested in upper sixth that then when you click on upper sixth it will format that and put a p dot two so when when it's upper sixth this is how you put page numbers okay and then when it's a harvard this is how numbers are are, are put okay when it's i triple e this is how numbers will be put when it's um american medical association this is how it will be cited like okay so that's how you you insert page numbers the first way the second way that you can insert page numbers is right on the go as you are citing right uh jennings right i can click on that before i even click ok right and already put a page number because i know it already and then it will insert the page number once and for all and, and if i'm using harvard uh both of them will be updated to have the uh page number okay and when you're doing in text citation um let's say you're saying according to according to uh insert citation jennings select it and then click on it page number two then click ok all right um it's gonna format it and then insert so i'm interested in these authors remember in text citation you want the authors out of the bracket if you don't know how to do uh in text citation uh please check on my um other video that is sliding at the top there uh, that is describing how to insert uh, how to do in text uh, citation okay um, and then you edit that citation um, and then you suppress author click ok right it's gonna format it and then have it uh, without authors inside the bracket and then while you're inside outside the bracket you paste okay so according to these people they said blah 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 okay so this is how you then do in text citation where you want page numbers to be included like that thank you for watching this video see you in the next one as i'll be talking about um, uh, how to cite two articles that are written by the same authors in the same year so watch out for the next video that is coming remember to subscribe like and share this video with your peers uh, with your colleagues, with your family, with your friends who are in the academic or who are in the research fraternity.